It still feels so freaking sad. Let me cry. Back to studying again. Good morning, everyone. It's currently October 6th, and it's like 9 o'clock, and I woke up feeling really fucking shitty. Why? Because my alarm clock didn't go off, right? You know what woke me up? The notification from the airlines telling me, Welcome to LA. Don't forget your luggage. Even though I canceled my flight a few days after I told my friend I sell my ticket, like, I forgot to unsubscribe from the text messages, but they should unsubscribe you if you, like, cancel the ticket no well, whatever and i know i know i know i know i know something better like i know when something like this happens it's because something better is going to happen it still feels really fucking shitty like i still feel so fucking sad because like i know i said in my other video the reason why i couldn't go is because of like financial issues well like i actually only sold the ticket to the benefit of other people and not myself and now i'm realizing like fuck like i could have been there like why do i have to be the good old daughter you know like like i already have other videos posted about where i'm crying about in hyphen but anyways um in today's video since i feel really fucking shitty i am going to try to make myself feel better by having a self-care day ignore the background i still haven't cleaned look at my little puppy right there oh she's so cute anyways so hi everyone welcome back to my channel and if you're new here hi i am Wanda, and i cry a lot plain and simple but today um we're going to do some self-care because i haven't done that in a while to the point that like my stretch patch i don't know if you guys can see it but like it's getting really bad um because i can't stop picking at it because of my fucking anxiety but anyway today we're gonna be doing some self care i hate how my hair looks so voluminous when i wake up but then i brush it and it's like this but also like my hair has a lot of oil i tried like this new biotin oil i'll tell you guys if it actually works <sighs> I don't know what I want to do. All I do know is that I want to clean my room because, like, look at this. Like, this is nothing. You guys, there's messes over here, messes over there. I don't know if I posted the video yet, but I actually found a vanity, like, sitting outside, like, outside my house. And I was like, I need it. And if it, it looks so nice. Damn, so I'm, like, all over here. Like, what is it that I normally do for a self-care day? And then I realized I haven't had a self-care day in a long time. <laughs> Like, I honestly don't even remember the last time that I actually took a day for myself and, like, just... <sighs> Those damn chickens. If you're watching this you have an older sister that takes care of you like your mom, go give her a hug. She probably needs it. <laughs> Fuck! Or just, like, in general, something that acts like your second parent. Like, go give them a hug. I- my god, I said I wasn't going to cry, but, like... I feel really sad, okay? Let me cry. Hey, it's editor me, and I just kind of wanted to stop by and be like, okay, I get it. It's a little bit dramatic, this video, but, like, your girl is going through a lot, and, like, an icon once said... Love being dramatic, because why would you ever deal with any emotion in a logical way? But I'm, like, all over here, like, trying not to cry, but actually crying and just letting it all out, feeling your emotions is other part. It's another part of self-care, so if you feel like crying, cry. I feel like bawling my eyes out right now, but first... We're going to meditate because I feel like I need to ground myself. Like, I've been saying that I don't have, like, the energy to be doing, like, like cleaning my room and, like, showering my dog. I feel like it's all giving... Anyways, whatever. We're going to meditate because, like, I need that right now. I need it. actually feels so much better <sighs> i actually do <laughs> like i don't know if i said that i'm pretty sure i vaguely said it in my other video but i kind of already knew that i wasn't going to be able to go to their concerts this year and <laughs> i had a dream that i was like a dancer or whatever and like i was like in the practice room or whatever i think that's a sign for me to go back to dancing because i loved dancing like <sighs> this is gonna be weird like let me know in the comments if you think this is weird but i literally had a dream that i was told by like one of the in hyphen members telling me like oh your faith is bigger than this and i was just like oh i don't know i just thought it was weird because like their tourist name is fate 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 i don't know maybe it's just like my subconscious trying to make myself feel better 
It's like, bitch, stop being the past. Get shit together. But anyways, uh, back to self-care. I'm gonna go make my food. I'm gonna cook for myself because I haven't cooked for myself in a while. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go make my food because I'm going to finish my schoolwork as I'm eating because I am way behind. Like your girl said, I can do this later. No, I'm behind. Like really behind. So I'm gonna make my food and then come back and do my schoolwork. Yeah, I'm gonna be productive this morning. That's another part of self care. I'm gonna be productive. Okay, so. So for today's menu, we have iced coffee. So we have iced coffee. And then we have leftovers from yesterday, which is bean. Which is egg. And I just added bacon to it because like, just plain eggs. Mm -hmm. And then toast. I wasn't sure if I just wanted butter or if I wanted scream cheese. So I made both. Butter and scream cheese. So now, you gotta set up for school. So a change of plans, fuck school, we're going to the mall. For real. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm gonna come back and finish. <laughs> So I just came back from shopping. Did a little self-care shopping. And this is what I got. So I got these little earrings. I've been wanting moonstone earrings for like the longest time, but I've never been able to find them. And I actually found them. They're so pretty. Like, and then I also got this necklace. And immediately when I saw this necklace, I was like, I need it. Like I was immediately attracted to this. I was like, I need this necklace and i got it at the henna shop at arizona mills i love this store i remember when it first opened i was like super obsessed with it and i had a really interesting conversation with the lady there it was good because i was telling her about like a dream that i had and then she's like oh that's really good like that means that you know like breaking bad habits and stuff and it's like that's what i'm trying to do and then i got these earrings i immediately like these these two items i was like automatically like attracted to them and these ones right here they're so pretty. It's like this, the moon, the sun, and then the snake. Did I tell you guys that I almost got attacked by a snake? I was at the mountain with my friend and there was a snake behind me and I didn't even know. I don't even know how long the snake was there until I heard the rattling and I freaked out and I ran. But the snake wasn't hurting me or anything. I just got really scared and I ran. These shoes, I fell in love with them. They were buy one, get one free. And my sister's girlfriend, Nadia, she's like, I'll get one and you'll get a pair. And I was like, <laughs> I love these. <laughs> They're so pretty. I'm actually going to take pictures for Instagram. So, back to studying, I guess. SA weighed heavily on the minds of the men who formed the Second Continental Congress. So I am taking a little break from school because... I'm gonna take a little break, watch a drama, and then drink my little pooping juice. And then we're gonna shower because it's hair wash day.